Good afternoon my friends. Today I travel to Star Bridge here in a beautiful city of Birmingham. I was looking for this place actually called Stuffed by Car Right. I'm gonna try to do like a food challenge. I don't know if I can do it because I do feel there's a lot of food and I don't eat a lot of food these days. I was lost actually for 10 minutes. I never, I never been here. It's, it's my first time, so I can't wait to go and try. I have seen that the, the place uh, um, on internet is really beautiful, and apparently just one person beat this food challenge that I'm going to try. But I don't know if I, I can do it. Even if I don't do it, I don't care. The fact I try is good. I'm just give you. I'm going to give you the facts and figures of this uh, food challenge. And um, here in a beautiful town, actually, of uh, Star Bridge. My goodness, the sat nav took me to a different place. Does it happen to you guys where you try to go somewhere and it always takes you on the wrong place? So there you go. You start by saying, Do you know, no, do you know anyone who could shovel it down and beat the clock to claim a free shirt? Wow! And you wouldn't pay if you beat the challenge as well. So here, for you to beat, you need to eat five bacon, five sausage, four eggs. I like well done, by the way, sir. And uh, four ash browns, five black pudding. Are you kidding me? I'm full already just to read this, guys. Mushrooms, crusty fried bread. Oh my goodness, I think there are just two, guys. Four toasts. Are you kidding? Triple cooked chips, beans, tomatoes, and unlimited tea or coffee. 30 minutes. That's what he says you need to, to eat. Must be finished. Are you kidding me? I think it would take me a day. They want me to finish in half an hour. I don't know. Anyway, it costs 25 pounds. If anyone can beat the, the current record set by the only member of the public to successfully complete the challenge of 24 minutes and 33 seconds. Are you kidding? That is incredible because there's a lot of food, let me to tell you. We'll also give them the challenge for free and they will give you a t-shirt as well. Let's go to see where they are. Really nice here. Wow, I love this alley where there's shops and all sorts of restaurants. I'm presuming just it, I reckon, is there. I reckon is the retro and vintage clothes. Let's check them out. He does smell nice. Let's check him out. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Oh my goodness, it smells nice. I want to try to do the challenge that you do. Do you want to tell me a little more? How long it takes or how long? Usually you get about 30 minutes. 30 uh, minutes. 30 minutes if you um, if you complete the challenge in 30 minutes. Yeah. You get a t-shirt. Oh. Um, if you beat the current record holder, which is 24, 24 33 seconds. Yeah, That's I it. have a look. Yeah. Um, then you get the meal for free as well. Oh, I see. Um, it's it's five sausage, five bacon, okay. a massive pile of mushrooms, yeah. three black pudding, four hash browns, four toast, yeah. four eggs, yeah. a bowl of chips, crusty fried bread, and uh, beans and tomatoes. Wow. I tell you what, guys, I feel full already. I haven't even started. Are you kidding me? Smells nice, I have to say. So, how much is that? Because I will have to pay. It's twenty-five pounds. Twenty-five pounds. Okay, I'll pay. Can I pay with card? Yes, of course. Yep. So actually, I will have to do in less than twenty-four thirty-three. Is that right? I would have to do in twenty-four thirty-two, for example. Yeah. Okay. That'd be br brilliant. <laughs> in your dreams, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it smells nice here. It's really beautiful, guys. Mm. There you go, Chief. Yeah. Tell me if you did it okay. That's all gone through. You sure? Uh, yeah. Okay, and uh, can I have some tea and one sugar? Yes. Yeah. If you don't mind. I'll yeah. Get that for you. Okay. I'm going to set my table outside if you don't mind. Okay. Is that okay? Not a problem. All right, thank you.
Can I just say guys, I do feel a little bit of pressure. I never done actually a food challenge and this is a lot of food. And I almost could say even before I started, actually I have failed. I'm not used to actually to eat a lot of food. I'm going to eat some, obvious, and I will review in the end and I'll tell them how good actually it is. But I'm, I'm coming here, um, have a little fun, eat something different. I do like it, very quirky, the place, really beautiful, the stuff is very friendly as well. I know a lot of YouTubers actually, they have even come here. Um, so I'm more interested, I'm going to be honest, is to try the food, how good is it is. I love the presentation of the food as well. I told them I like my eggs, well done. I don't know if you like uh, that way. Hope you are all okay. And let's do this because I do look forward. Do look forward. I'm ready to eat. It's very windy today and it did rain more than an hour ago. It did rain a lot. I have to say I was a little concerned. Well, if it rains, I would be inside this and guys. So it wouldn't be a big of a problem really. But I do prefer to stay outside even in the winter as I have stayed several times below zero. So, let's hope when they bring, they will um, open even more appetite. But I do feel it's a lot of food, so, in a way. But I'm going to eat, doesn't matter the amount. As long as I um, enjoy the meal, that is the main thing, isn't guys? So, hope you, one day you'll do the same. And I think the record is a lady. Um, I don't know who she is. Actually, she did eat everything in nine minutes. Are you kidding me? That is not even eating. I think she drank the, the she just swallowed the, the the food. I couldn't do that. Nine minutes. That is too fast. And I couldn't eat as fast as that. I do like to, to taste the food, absorb the smells, taste the smells, etc. And that's what I like. I'm not here to try to eat as much or even try to beat the record. I just can't because that is going to be almost impossible. Not because I'm defeated, it's because myself I'm not used to it. But I'm going to enjoy the food, there's no doubt about that. It's so windy, I just feel the wind coming through this valley or alley because it's very narrow. But the sun at least is out, thank God. And that is really nice. And it smells so nice. It does smell really nice. I just can smell it from there. There you go. Look at the size of those chips. Oh my goodness. There's the toast. Thank you very much. It looks amazing. Look at this, guys. <laughs> How many toasts are you kidding me? Two, four, six, eight. You must be joking, right? Oh my God. How many toasts? <laughs> You must be joking, right? Do you want me to eat all of this? Even this food here, I would struggle. There's still more to come, apparently. Wow, the chips, they look crispy, huge, big. So four fried eggs. I had mine well done because that is the way I like it. I do like a toast as well. Are you going to bring me like some forks or knives and a t um, tissue so I can clean my... Are you kidding me, guys? They just sent me with a shovel. Did they run out of plate? For God's sake, are you kidding me? It wouldn't surprise me, I actually came from a farm, not too far from here. Oh, thank you very much, really appreciate it. There you go. <laughs> I love the presentation. Oh, breakfast. <laughs> a giant breakfast. This is cool. Oh my goodness, are you kidding me? This is big, oh my God. Too much for me, really. I'm not going to lie to you guys, this is huge, my goodness. But they should have more respect for Mr. Wiggs. Serving food in a shovel to me, are you kidding me? Perhaps they use this for work and they serve the, the food to me. You must be joking, right? I'm here to taste the food, see how good it is, is it is, because this is too much for me. I need to be realistic, I would be lying, and I'm not like that. But I do like toast, so I'm going to have a fried egg with toast, why not? Hey, let's do this. I know what I need and they forgot this, my cup of tea, because I feel I need to drink something. Let's dig in again. Wow. 
delicious the beans really nice with the very strong tomato flavor this is delicious actually mm. Wow, this is one of the best presented meals that I ever had. Wow. Let's go have some mushrooms. Mm. That is delicious. Hmm. Black pudding, look at that, look how thick is that? Three of them. <laughs> mm. Very good. This is so delicious. I tell you what, I'm gonna have a little more of the beans because they are delicious. Don't know how they make the, the sauce. I know it, it does taste a lot of tomato, but they put something else. Mmm, delicious, perfect. I found them easy to eat as well. Let's try now the sausage. Now sausage, I always feel they are very tricky. Very tricky. Some you do like more than the others, so. That was delicious actually, the sausage, really delicious. I tell you what guys, you don't know, but I'm gonna tell you. When I have the English breakfast, the, my favorite part of the meal is the ash browns. And there you go, I got four here. Look very crispy. Mm. There's always a downside to it outside. It's very windy here. The, the wind just goes through this um, narrow passage, let's we say. It's just nine foot wide and it, the food is getting cold very quickly. Look at this, very thick chips. <laughs> I feel stuffed <laughs> and you know what this is this has got the right name stuffed that's how I feel those chips they are delicious mm. So far so good. Heaven. <laughs> A lot of dark clouds. Can you see? The sun just disappear. It can rain at any time. No, please hold it there. Let's gonna try the fried bread. I haven't eaten for ages. Let me tell for ages I haven't eaten actually fried bread. Are you kidding me? They do have a lot of oil. Mm. I'm gonna have more mushrooms. They are really delicious. They taste really nice. Mm.
<laughs> wow. Oh wow, this was incredible, an amazing experience. Perhaps you could be disappointed. I haven't done actually a challenge. I would never beat nine minutes. That is the record. But I, as long as I would eat in less than 24 minutes, 33 seconds, I wouldn't pay, it would be free. So the meal would be free and I would have even a t-shirt. Just start to rain lightly. But look at that, there's still lots of food here. In the shovel, are you kidding me? That's why perhaps they called the shovel. This was really good. The place is so beautiful, very quirky. Did you notice, when I recorded inside, some of the seats actually, they are made out of a pallet. Fantastic idea, eh? You don't need to buy expensive furniture, guys. This is just too much. I couldn't beat. I'm happy actually that I failed the food challenge. Yeah, I just said I'm really happy because all the food was fantastic from the toast, the fried bread, the beans, tomato, fried eggs, the chips, they are crispy, fluffy on inside, really delicious, so thick. Never had such a thick chips. Look at this. This is huge. Are you kidding me? But so delicious as well. Mm. The ash browns, once again, they were delicious, really good. The black pudding as well, mushrooms, I loved the, the sausage. So everything in a way was perfect, it was perfect. The stuff very friendly as well. You can drink as many teas or coffees as you want. If you come here to do the challenge, 25 pounds, let me just to remind you. But even I couldn't beat the challenge, in a way I'm so happy that I came here. So I'm. Uh, Happy loser, let's we say. I did enjoy, this was incredible. Good stuff, like I said, and I'm happy that I came here. Another food review, what did you think? Would you do it? Do you think you could eat um, in less than half an hour? In this case, it's 24 minutes and 33 seconds. I couldn't, it was too much for me, but I'm happy. I'm gonna take home. I can enjoy actually the meal for several days, and I did enjoy it. I'm just gonna say, I'm gonna rate it. How much would you rate it? I'm going to tell you, I don't have no problems whatsoever to give them 10 out of 10, guys. Yeah, the food, it was just delicious, cooked to perfection. That's what I have to say. Everything it was just fantastic and very delicious. So I did enjoy it. This place did at the Vava Room. Shakalalulu. Stay tuned for another 10 years and Mr. Wiggs videos, guys. You are all awesome. Thanks for watching. I'll see you on the next one.